Hey guys. Welcome back to this series. If you haven't watched the first video, watch it now. In the last video, we made the basic attack for your weapon. Today, I will show you how to make variants of your weapon and also how to make special abilities. But first, let's fix a few bugs from the previous video. Inside the anti-ragdoll script, change all of it to this. Inside the weapon script, replace the player and character variables with this. There will be a paste bin, so don't worry if you don't understand. Finally, change the raggle module script to this. There wasn't a bug with it, people were just asking for collidable limbs, and I also made the character spin a little bit too. This will also be in the paste bin. Now let's start making some weapons. I'm going to start off by making the overkill glove. Copy your weapon and change the name. Now edit the stats of your new weapon. Since this is overkill, you don't need to activate the glove for it to do damage. Make a while loop and put the damage function inside the loop. Pause now. Now I'm gonna change the model. The good thing about making new weapons, is that they are easy and quick to make. Now we are going to add sounds to the attacks. Make a new folder called sounds and put it in server storage. Then get a sound from the toolbox and import it into the folder. Once you've added your sounds, make a new module script called sound inside the attack module script. Pause now. Now go into the attack module script and copy this down. Pause now. Now, go into every weapon script and add this to the attack data based on what you called your sound in the folder. I set my sound to bonk because I have a sound called bonk in my folder in server storage. Now do this with every weapon you have made so far. Let's see if it works. And it works now. Now we are going to make an ability weapon. Copy the default weapon and change the name. I am going to be remaking the Woa Glove. Change how the model looks and then insert a local script into the tool. We are going to be using Context Action Service. This service will create buttons for mobile meaning you don't have to manually add key for it. Pause now. It should print ability whenever you press E. I will go through mobile support on another video. Add a remote event called ability to the tool. Go onto the server script in the tool and add ability to bounce and ability cooldown variables. Pause now. Now go back into the local script and copy what I do. Copy all of this down and change tool inside the fire server to character. Add this line to the server script in the tool. Now copy down this function. 
Whatever you write in here will run whenever a player uses an ability. Only follow now if you want to make the WoA glove. Actually one more thing. Go into the check module script in server script service and create a new function. Pause now. Go back into the server tool script. Copy this line. Just add this if statement and then write whatever you want your ability to be. Now this is just for the WOA glove. Make a new module script inside the module folder called spatial. Pause now and write this function. Now make a new folder in workspace called players. Go onto the main script in server script service. Copy down these two lines. Now go back into the spatial module script. Pause now. Require the spatial module in the server tool script. Now, we are just going to print every player 20 studs or closer to the character. Pause now. It works. Go on to the state module script and wrap all the code inside the function in a task.spawn function. Like this. Go into the attack module script and create a new function. So I kinda messed up here a bit, so I'm going to show you what the attack function looks like at the end and also show you all the other scripts. Add this function to the knockback module script. Add this function to the attack module script. Add this to the tool server script. There will be a paste bin for all of these. Finally, add these two lines I select to the spatial module script. And that's it. Next video. I will be going through equipping the gloves and getting slaps whenever you attack someone. If you have any problems, join the Discord. There is also a paste bin, but don't just mindlessly copy and paste everything in there into one script. The code is split up into multiple sections for each script. Check the commented part above each section to see where that code should be going. Bye bye